Hello again, it's, it's James Taylor, the author of Jazz and Improvised Piano, and in this video I'm just going to put down a bass line for you to improvise over the top of. So, this, this, this is for Ladybird of course. So, for this one then, um, I'd like you to just uh, play, you can either play right hand on its own, playing the, the various scales as discussed, um, or you can play the left hand chords, um, those are, are, are the same chords that, of course, you learn in the right hand. <laughs> you can play the chords in the left hand, and the right hand can improvise in the, in, in, in the scales as discussed, over the top of these chords. Right, okay then, so I'll just give you a bass line, straight in. One, two, one, two, three, four. F minor, B flat seven, C, B flat minor seven, E flat seven, A flat major seven, A minor seven, D seven, D minor seven, G seven, and just C major, and nothing here. Run again, C major, F minor, B flat seven, C major, B flat minor. E flat seven, A flat major, A minor, D seven, D minor seven, G seven, and silence in the left hand for this. Oh, uh, C major again, and F minor, B flat seven, C major, B flat minor seven, E flat seven. E, A flat 7 runner. A minor, D7, D minor 7, G7, and C major, and nothing. C, F minor, B flat 7, B flat minor 7, E flat 7, A flat major. A minor 7, D7, D7, G7, um, once more, B flat minor 7, E flat 7, A flat major 7, A minor 7, D7, D minus seven, G seven, nothing, and let's play a C major seven chord to finish, and play a flourish of white notes in the right hand, and that'll sound great. Okay, I do hope this episode has been helpful.